Hi again, everybody. It is Victor King from Playbook. I'm the over-under guy at Playbook. And we've got a free play for you this week in NFL Week 11 action. A free totals play before I get into it real quick. I'll run down last week's results again in the NFL. As everybody knows by now, it's been a very low-scoring season this week in the NFL. Last week, there were seven overs, seven unders. We're now 10 weeks into the NFL 2022 season, and there has yet to be a week in which there were more overs than unders. It's either been more unders than overs or a split down the middle week like what happened last week. On the season, there's been 62 overs, 87 unders, one tie. That's 58% of all games in the NFL this season that have been going under the total with a low average of only 43.9 combined points per game. Again, if you're not betting the unders these days, you're probably taking a big hit out of your gambling bankroll. Your uh, results in the NFL through the uh, first 10 weeks, I'll go by really, really quickly here, week by week. Week one, and when I uh, give you the numbers, the first number is overs, the second number is always unders. Week one went 5-11 and 11 over under. Week two, 5-10-1. Week three, 8-8. Eight and eight. Week four, 8-8. Eight and eight. Week five, 7-9. and nine. Week six, 4-10. and ten. Week seven, 7-7. Seven and seven. Week eight, seven and eight. Week nine went four and nine over under. And again, last week's record, seven overs and seven unders. Now, before I get into our free play for the week, we've got a big one in the NFL. Last week, our NFL over of the week was in the Detroit Lions, Chicago Bears game. Final score, 31 to 30. We brought home the bacon with that one. And we want to thank all sharp over under betters who joined us at playbooksports.com for that over of the week in the NFL. We've got another one going this week. Four-star best bet over the week in NFL Week 11 action. And it's available at the playbooksports.com website. For our free play this week, we are going to give the ball to King's best friend. That would be Tuco, our dog. And he's going to be playing the Philadelphia Eagles this week. Now, Tuco was all set to play the Buffalo Bills to go over the total in their game against Cleveland this week until the Tuesday morning weather report came in. Heavy snow, strong winds, blizzard conditions. They're even saying that Buffalo could get three to six feet of snow this weekend. So we're going to kind of bail on that game, and Tuco is going to go to his second-choice team. That's going to be the Philadelphia Eagles to score over 25 and a half points in the controlled indoor environment of the Indianapolis Lucas Oil Stadiums. Again, this is a team total where we're just playing the over-under for one team. And in this case, it's the Eagles. Over 25 and a half points. You got a pissed off Philadelphia team. They just lost in Monday Night Football. They got upset by Washington as a 10-point favorite. They are looking for a whipping boy to take their aggression out on. And they got one this week in the Colts. You know, the Eagles have actually been a better offensive team on the road this season at 27.8 points per game and 393 offensive yards per game than they have been at home. So we're getting them in their best role. In addition, the Eagles have averaged 29.5 points per game away versus all non-division opponents in the last two years, 31.6 points per game in the last four years, against any losing non-division opponent like the Colts, and 28.5 points per game as favorites when playing after a Monday night game. And with Philly losing their game on Monday night, our database tells us that 7-1 and one or better teams in the NFL off their first loss of the season have averaged 30.7 points per game in their next game. That's the case for the Eagles this particular week. As far as the Colts go, when priced as home underdogs, the Colts have allowed 29.7 points per game in the last five years. And off a dog win the previous week, the Colts have allowed 29.5 points per game in the last two years. Everything is setting up 
for Philadelphia to get to 30 or more points in this game on the road indoors against Indianapolis. Your free play of the week. Philadelphia Eagles, their team total over 25 and a half points. Don't forget to go to playbooksports.com for our four star over of the week in the NFL. Keep fighting the good fight. This is Victor King from playbooksports.com. Have a great week, and we'll talk to you next week for Week 12 NFL Action.